गुड इवनिंग डेयर स्टूडेंट्स समर एग्जाम एंड प्रैक्टिस क्वेश्चन आई एम गोइंग टू सॉल्व टूडे लेट एस सी द फर्स्ट क्वेश्चन द लास्ट वीडियो हैव टेकन मच टाइम इट्स ओके ओके एग्जाम एंड क्वेश्चन दो हजार अटेम्प्ट इन करेक्ट ए पर्सन वॉक्स ए सर्टन डिस्टेंस half of the distance he walks at a speed of 4 km per hour and the remaining distance at a speed of 5 km per hour the total time taken to travel the distance is 9 hours what is the total distance covered i repeat the question so distance is equal to speed into time distance by speed equal to time This is one formula. A person walks certain distance. Let the distance be x. Half of the distance, x by two. Distance by speed. His speed is four kilometers per hour. And the remaining distance, that means remaining half. His speed is five kilometers per hour. The total time taken to travel the distance is nine hours. So this is time nine hours. This is four kilometers per hour. This is five kilometers per hour. What is x value? That is the total distance. So we can solve it x by eight plus x by ten. It's equal to nine. So ten and eight, forty is LCM. It fives are. Ten fours are so nine by forty x is equal to nine. X is equal to forty km. Forty km. Hope this question is clear for all of you. Half of the distance, one speed four kilometers per hour. A remaining half at five kilometers per hour. This is km. Ph. Okay. Now there is a trick for this. Then in other words, speeds are four into five and divided by four plus five. So product of the speeds by sum of the speeds into time into nine. This is a trick, dear friends. If you are able to solve it. The trick is four into five by four plus five into time. That is twenty by nine into nine nine and cancel. That's called twenty km. This is half of the distance. Half of the distance is twenty. Full distance will be forty. Half of the distance is twenty. Full distance will be forty. This is one method. Product by sum into time. Let us see the second question. A person salary reduced by ten percent. By what percentage should be added to get back to the original salary? Whenever you say reduced, whenever we say reduced, we use R by hundred minus R into hundred. This is the formula. That is nothing but reduced by ten percent. Reduced by ten. Hundred minus ten is ninety into hundred. Zero zero get cancelled. Hundred by nine. Nine less than ninety nine. One by nine. 
So a person salary is reduced by 10 percent. By what percentage should be added? 11 1 by 9 percentage must be added to get back to the original salary. Let us see the next one. In a car where toast box cover 15 degrees, toast box is called 15 degrees. How many spokes are there for entire car? Now, dear students, entire means 360 degrees. Entire means 360 degrees. So, our two spokes 15 degrees. 15 to the 30. 15 to the 60. So, 15 into 24, it is 360. So, 2 into 24, it is 48. So, 15 into 24 is 360. So 2 into 24 is 48. So 48 spokes. 48 spokes for one wheel. There are four wheels. How many spokes are there for entire car? So 48 into 4. 160 plus 24. 184 spokes. 24 into 4, that is 48. 48 into 4, 40 into 4, 160 plus 8, 4 is 32. 160 plus 32, 192 spokes. Let us see question number 4. Two persons can do a job in 8 days. Suppose it is A, this is B. A plus B can do a job in 8 days. First person alone can do it in 24 days. A alone will do it in 24 days. B alone will do it in how many days? Second person takes how much to finish the job. So I am going to use a trick. That is nothing but I am doing this. 24 into 8 by 24 minus 8. So 24 into 8 divided by 24 minus 8 is 16. 8 twos are 2 twelves are. 12 days is the answer. Simple trick. Okay. Product by difference. Otherwise, 1 by 8. Two persons can do it in 1 by 8. 1 by 8 minus 1 can do it in 1 by 24. 1 by 8 minus 1 by 24, L7 is 24. A3 is a minus 1. 2 by 24, 1 by 12 days. That's nothing but 12 days. All these questions are clear. Dear students, these are Hexaware practice questions from Hexaware old models. Okay? Please let us see the next one. So dear students, let us see the next one. 30 men can complete a work in 16 days. 6 days after they started the work, 20 more men joined them. Remaining work is completed by them in how many days? Now you know that 30 men are working 16 days. So 30 into 16. 480 units of work is completed by 30 men in 16 days, 480 units. Now 6 days after they started the work. So 30 men are working for 6 days. What happens? 180 units, 16 days of 180 units of work have been completed by them in 6 days. 20 more men joined them. So now 480 minus 180 per day. It is 300 units which is left. For doing this 300 units, earlier we had 30 men, 20 more men joined them. 20 more men joined them. So we have 50 now. That is equal to 6 days. 5, 6 are 30.